Hi there, I'm Christopher Dunnigan. This is HandmadeInVermont.com and today we're talking about the Hubberton Ford's Neolith dedicated LED pendant 137870. This is from Hubberton Forge's Synchronicity Collection which uses hand cut fire polished crystals and handmade pieces of glass sourced from studios all over the world. Okay, let's get into a lot of details on this. So let's talk about the, the size of the fixture body itself and that's going to be that bar you see on the bottom and then those two pipes you see coming up and that's going to be your overall height of those pipes to the bottom of that's going to be 21.9 inches. This is a long fixture. It's 61 inches long and then the, um, the width of it's only 5.3 so it's long and, and very skinny. It's great to go over a like um, let's say a, a long kitchen island I guess or if you can put it over a long dining table that would be awesome. Okay now when we talk about overall height now we're talking about the distance from the bottom of the fixture to the ceiling itself this is going to be hanging by two cables and they're, they're both structural however one's carrying a positive charge and one's carrying a uh, negative charge and these are low voltage so in, in case anybody accidentally pulled this down they would never get hurt because of the low voltage on that so the shortest this is, can be is 25 inches from the bottom of the fixture to the ceiling coming down longest is, is 75 if you need this to be longer than 75 just let us know you can email us and say we're looking at the 137870 and we need it to be X and your X could be 100 inches, 120 inches or whatever. I take your email, it goes over to Hubberton Forge to the customs department and then rolls back over to me and I can give you uh, details about that. Okay, so I want to talk about the canopy up on the ceiling. That canopy is going to be uh, holding a transformer and a driver because it, remember it's a dedicated LED fixture. Canopy um, is 5.3 inches wide and 10.3 inches long going over your standard 4 inch junction box. Now on top of that you have a long linear suspension bar that's going to be about 61 inches long so kind of keep that in mind if you guys are using this with beams so you just can't go off the canopy size of the 5.3 by 10.3 you have to talk about that whole thing it's also coming in at 45 pounds which means that anything over 25 pounds we have to re recommend that you uh, put this over or onto a junction box that is independent of like just the um, the, the drywall basically. So it has to be attached to the building. Some of the details to see all of this stuff is to look at the installations instructions. So let's do that now. If you're on the page for this on Handmade in Vermont, look over on this side of the screen, midway down a little bit, you're going to see a link. It's going to say click here for installations instructions PDF. Open that up for me. That is going to show you how everything goes together. It's very simple. But the, the really important part, it's going to show you what the canopy is like, what the inside of the canopy is like, and how it's going to go on your junction box. These are very important things. Uh, slope ceiling adaptable to 45 degrees, so you guys are all set there. Let's jump into uh, the lumens and the wattage and all that good stuff. So, like I said, this is dedicated LED. You have uh, dedicated LED strips that are going to be embedded in that bottom bar, top and bottom. So light's going to be coming up and, and eliminating those glass gems. And it's also going to be going down to provide some task lighting. 25 watts total. That's 1,500 lumens, the equivalent of probably about a 150-watt bulb. This is a dimmable fixture. You're going to want to put it on a dimmer that's set up for LEDs. Make sure you tell your installer all about that. Let's get into finishes now. If you're, if you're on the HandmadeInVermont.com website, look over on this side of the screen. Midway down, you're going to see a tab. It's going to say uh, Finishes Help Guide. Click on that for me. That, there's going to be a video on there of me talking to you guys about the differences in Hubberton Forge finishes and how they can look on different types of forging. I'm going to be talking about a chart a little farther down on the page. You'll see it next to me here. It's going to kind of go over the differences between heavy forging and non-heavy forging and it'll be talked about in that video. So it's really important that you kind of watch the video, use the chart. You can click on that chart on different things. So you can click on dark smoke and a big page will pop up and show you lots of different things in dark smoke. Click on burnished steel or, or uh, natural iron, it'll do the same thing. But it's really important that you understand how Hubbard's Forge's finishes are kind of divided into translucent and opaque and how they can look on different, on different fixtures. Uh, our showroom in Vermont has over, well, we're up to 400 Hubberton Forge fixtures spread across two floors. We have a What's On Display page. It's way up there in those red tabs again. So click on that and you can see what we have to show you. That changes all the time because we're always adding things as they come out. Showrooms open every day except Sunday from 11 to 6. We have an amazing clearance center here too. Clearance center stuff is 75% off MSRP. It's returns, discontinued things, and showroom samples. If you were coming to visit us, 
bring a good sized vehicle, something like a big SUV or maybe a small truck or something like that because you might find something in the clearance center that you want to take home and it's a lot of fun to go through. 75% off MSRP is an amazing bargain so you should really take advantage of it if you can. Like I said, we're open every day except Sunday from 11 to 6. I'm here every day except Sunday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Time. You can call us at 802-446-2400 during business hours. You can email us 24 hours a day, seven days a week, all the time. We love to answer emails. When you buy your Hubberton Forge fixtures from handmadeinvermont.com, shipping is free to every state except Alaska and Hawaii. There's no tax if we ship out of the state of Vermont, and we're the only dealer with 90-day returns and no restocking fees. No one else even comes close to that. Some larger items are non-returnable. We'll always tell you about that. It'll be in the description thing that part of the description underneath uh, on the very bottom. So keep an eye out for that. <clears throat> we also offer a rush program. Hubberton Forge generally takes about three to four weeks to get product out. They don't stock anything. That's how you're going to get all your finishes, your adjustable ranges to play with, all those things. We can cut that time in half and it's super inexpensive. If you want to know more, drop a quick email and I can uh, walk you through the whole thing, okay? So if you guys have any other questions, let me know. Love to see you in our showroom sometime and have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.